This week in your weekly upgrade, we go from chaos to troubleshooting with your Chromebook. We will show you an ad-free option in the realm of YouTube, and we got something special that may or may not include food, and I really hope it does. I'm Jordan R, and this is your weekly upgrade. We know it's your favorite thing to do when you log in. Why do I have no space on my Chromebook? All I see are green screens on Google Me. Why is my camera that's connected to my TV, that's connected to my camcorder, that's connected to my fireplace not working? It won't turn on. Too far? How about... Yes, lots of issues, but instead of losing your mind and turning your Chromebook into its own personal tablet, why not use our handy little doc on troubleshooting the seven steps to a happy Chromebook? It's got seven key items we have seen over and over again in office hours to walk you through how to keep your Chromebook healthy. It has a link to the good and bad extensions, how to reset the Wi-Fi, or if it's a hardware issue, we have a link to our client service center. Just open the link in the description of this video, bookmark it on your Chromebook, and be well. Are you showing a video from YouTube to your class? Tired of seeing all the ads, pop-ups, or possibly inappropriate content links that follow at the end that may or may not pop up given you've already previewed the video you're going to show? Well, have we got good news for you. Just check out watchkin.com. As the site says, watch responsibly for education, for a break, for zombies, for fun. Super easy to use, just copy the link from YouTube, paste it in the nice little bar, and then it opens your video in its own tab, commercial free. So if you need to save that, just copy the Watchkin link and you're good to go. Now you don't have to worry about anything that may pop up. So go ahead, show and share your incredible and most educational video like this one here. Who knew cats could be trained so easily? Who wants lunch? I do, I do. Who then uses that sacred time during lunch to then jump on office hours or open that doc to figure out how a specific new item works for your class? Well, I have Chelsea and I have Katie from Team Awesome here to introduce to you how you can have your very own staff lunch. Welcome ladies. Hi Jordan. So Chelsea, tell me how a principal or staff member sets this up. Well Jordan, it is as easy as having your principal or vice principal fill out our request form that they've already received by email from our amazing VP, Kristen Grant. In that form, they can just let us know the days of the weeks and the times that work best for your school and Team Awesome will do the rest. So Katie, um, what kind of topics do you guys discuss? Well, we are able to share tips and tricks from all of our handy Google apps, but we're happy to discuss all things technology within OCDSB and beyond. Well, thank you, Chelsea, and thank you, Katie, and I hope you wonderful people have a wonderful day. Well, that's it for today's weekly upgrade. You know I'm gonna say it, so I'll keep it going. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to always stay upgraded. Also, office hours have changed just slightly, but it's always a great option if you need direct or immediate help. Have yourself a wonderful day, and if you have a moment, take the time to make someone else's day wonderful. It might just be a fun message or a quick hi or hello. Other than that, play us out, Piano Cat. Oh.